Hello, dear friends. Behind me is Taiping Lake. It's one of the famous Chinese lakes. It's well known for its location, next to the Huangshan mountain range, and also for Taiping Hokui tea. They are popular in China. So this place is very popular amongst tourists. Moreover, wealthy Chinese people love to build mansions on the shores of this lake. Today we'll talk about the 10 famous teas of China. Maybe you heard the term Shui Da Ming Cha. The term emerged in China in 1959, when the 10 most famous teas of China were chosen at the country level in order to popularize them. This list shows the state of the tea market at that time. The list contains green teas, like Shi Hu Longjing and Biu Chun from Lake Dun Tin Hu in Hunan province, and oolong teas. What's interesting, that instead of Da Hong Pao, there's Wu Yi Yan Cha, rock tea from Wu Yishan which once again confirms our version of the Da Hong Pao name origins. The list also contains Jie Guanyin from Anxi, Luan Guapian from Anhui, Qimen Hongcha, red tea from Jiangxi. It's a high-grade version of Yixing red tea. Huangshan Maofang from Huangshan Mountains. Jungshang Injeng from Jungshang Island in Henan province. And tea from Jiu Tiang, if I'm not mistaken. Let me check it. It shows that some teas are not that popular anymore. Ah, here it is. Lushan Yu Nu. It's a green tea. I've already mentioned all the others. As I was saying, this list shows the state of the market at that time. Because nowadays, you can find more unofficial lists of famous teas. According to some large tea stores and several institutes of tea, this top 10 list is no longer relevant. In the new lists, you can find all sorts of poor teas Hecha, dark tea from Henan, which is gaining popularity. However, there are neither Guangdong Oolong teas, like Fenghuang Dangsong, nor Shishuan teas, including Juye Tin or yellow teas, like Mengding Huangya, no Jian Hong from Yunnan. So the list is missing a large number of teas that are actually very popular in China. By the way, Taiping Hokui is also missing. I would say that this list is abstract and far from reality. It has to be changed at the country level. Or enrich the list with popular teas. Nevertheless, less popular teas like Qimen Hongcha and others are very proud to be in this official list. This is probably the only thing that keeps them popularish in comparison with giants like Pua or Hunan dark tea which is gaining popularity. This is it. I wish you great tea parties and ceremonies. <laughs> See you online and offline. If you have any questions, you can ask me in VK. You can find the link below this video. Subscribe to the channel. I hope to see you again.